Hi guys, did you miss me? How's everybody doing? Okay, well this video I'm doing for a specific reason, but I wanted to say hi to everybody and I will get back to you on the videos. I'm just not sure exactly which direction to go with them right now. Uh, there's a lot going on uh, because of last year. So everybody that worked last year, thank you so much. You have no idea how much was done. But that's a case of be careful what you ask for because I was really tired of things going slowly. So I asked to be on a timeline where it moved quicker. I just didn't know it was going to have the effect that it did on my body. So I had to basically lower my vibrations quite a bit, which was thanks to uh, really one specific person. So thank you very much for that. Uh, because at that point I was able to um, bring in all of you guys and a lot of work was done to increase the vibrations very quickly. So on New Year's Eve, uh, thanks to kind of the setup that was involved throughout the year, we made massive, massive changes. Um, yeah, I need to do a different video on that. So I need to stop talking about that and do what I wanted to do this video on. Okay, this video is on uh, when you do a session with me. Okay, so really I don't call myself a psychic. I've seen what they do and it's very linearly. And what I do is when you contact me via email and want to set up a session, what I do is I go and I talk to your higher self. Kind of from, I go up to my higher self and over. My higher self and your higher self have a conflap. We have a chit chat. And I kind of, from that point, get a picture of why you came, your big picture. You know, I've talked to you guys about how when you come here, there is a kind of think of it like there is a picture, a complete picture, only it's from all directions and it's very complex, right? And then when you come down in human form, that picture is broken apart into jigsaw pieces. And this life you're putting the jigsaw pieces back together. And you can do that however you want to do it. You can do it with 10, 10 pieces or 10 billion pieces. How complex you make that is up to you and how your life is. Okay? So what I do is I go over to your higher self so I can see the big picture. Not from your perspective in your either... 10 or 10 billion pieces, but rather the complete picture. Okay? Then I come back and over, and then I set up the Skype session with you. And then, once I do that, I usually have you look at me in the eye, so I can see your eyes. Eyes are the windows to the soul, and I can connect with all of the different layers that are in physical form. And then I go from that perspective, again, up to your higher self say hey again and we move forward now usually um usually what will happen is some part of you your physical body or your higher self will have things to say will have things that they want to say to you and usually i will start off by saying that uh, to make sure that that message is brought in brought through usually Gaia wants to say something to you so I usually do that and then uh, usually although there is no set pattern on this all of this I do in the flow uh, completely in the now I don't pre-think any of this but I would suggest guys that it you write down your questions before the session I know you think that you've had these questions for a long time and there's no way that you would forget them but people do frequently um, almost every time they forget uh, what their questions were so please write down your questions before you get to me and that is kind of the outlay of of how it works uh, for those of you who have had a session that watch this uh, just if you would just explain below how yours went just to make people more at ease there is nothing that can be wrong there's no question that is a stupid question um, please feel free to ask whatever you want to ask. 
and I will be completely honest with you, but do not ask things like, when will I, my business be successful? When will I meet the love of my life? When will there be peace on the planet? Because there are timelines for all of those things. But every single one of them, there are timelines that you can get on and you can have it. In the moment that we are talking, see, that's what happens with psychics frequently. Is a psychic, will, you'll ask a psychic, okay, when will I uh, meet the love of my life? And they'll say, well, I see you meeting them in the next year, in March. There's snow on the ground. Um, it must be after Christmas because there's no Christmas decor, you know, that kind of stuff. But what happens is that's just one timeline. And there are probably many timelines where you meet the, the love of your life. Okay? So don't ask me those kind of questions. Because I'm going to tell you that you can have all, any and everything that you've asked for. If it's on your mind and you've thought about it, you have created a timeline that you have it. The question is, how do you match that timeline? How do you get to that timeline? That's the question that you have to ask yourself. And your way of getting there is very different than anyone else's. Okay? That's the whole point. Is your life is going to be very different from everyone else's. Okay? Other than that, um, I do talk to dead people for you. Um, it's not my favorite thing to do, but I can talk to them. Um, I'm not going to be tested. If I, uh, you know, Your dead people are dead. Um, if they're still attached to the earth, then they haven't turned around and looked the other direction. So they don't have a lot of those kind of answers for you. If they've left the game altogether, I can call that back, them back into the game. But remember that whoever you call in is the complete, total consciousness of the person that you knew as simply a human. Being a human is very, very small restricted aspect of who uh, we are as a total and complete God. So they may be a little bit different. Uh, they're usually a lot different from what you remember. Um, I can already tell you everyone that's dead, no matter if they do stay somewhat attached to the planet Earth, everyone that's dead is happy and glad to be there. So there is no need to worry. You can certainly ask me that question. I can call them in and they can tell you themselves. But I guarantee you it's going to be the same answer. So I would suggest that you ask other things. Uh, okay? So I just want you guys to kind of have a feel for what this session is going to be like. A little bit, although everyone is different, so that you can understand that we are, um, what I deal with is, um, not really the same as human matters. What I normally talk about is your consciousness. Usually who I talk to are star seeds, so I try to explain to them, um, what they came here to do. Uh, it's difficult to explain because you're dealing with planetary energies, but I do the best that I can, and I'm, I hope that it helps uh, the star seeds that do have sessions with me. So for everyone who's set up to do a session, and all of you guys who have done sessions, uh, thank you very much for the support, and I hope it was worth it for you. Uh, certainly every one of you who have done a session your vibrations are less chaotic um, by the time we're done with a session. And that is good for the planet. It's also good for you, although you may not feel it immediately. All right? Okay, I think I covered everything I meant to cover. So, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. All right? Love you bunches. Huge hugs. Bye now.